welcome back to the Wolf Among Us part 6. And we're going to continue looking around the Toad's house. That more blood? No, just a clean space in the dust. <laughs> more blood. Did you move something? Ah, uh, maybe one of Junior's toys or something? I mean, who knows? <laughs> more. You expect more blood. So you know he's hiding something. That used to be there. That's what I was thinking. The lamp. Bloody hell, Bigby. What sinister bit have you uncovered this time? I left the tap water running? Didn't stop the recycling? What's the point of all this, mate? Really? The lamp was the here. The broken lamp used to be here, right? Just tell me what happened. Nothing happened, mate. Nothing! And why did the lamp have to be there? Of all the blooming pointless inquiries. It's my own place. Don't you think I'll know what happens in it? The mark because the, the lamp was always over here, Toad. It was over here, and now it's there. The space in the dust is from where you well, moved I did it. some refiguring. Who fucking cares? Bloody hell, mate. Come on, get off with this. <laughs> Big B, come on. I'm begging for mercy over here, old boy. I was looking forward to a nice afternoon. Just me and me son, and you've taken up enough of a day with all this... They're sniffing around at me private belongings. You I'm called sorry me over I here. Call. Really, I am. But will exactly. you please, please, just bugger off? Not yet. Not yet? You say to my face that you think I'm hiding something from you. Well, you've had to go out of the room for a fair bit of time now. Nothing's here. So when? When are you going to leave? I mean, I feel like I'm on trial here. In my own bloody home. It's not seemly. When? When I figure out what's going on here, Toad. You can help the process along, you know. How? How am I going to help the process along? By admitting what happened. I cut me end. I broke the lamp. I forgot my keys, so I climbed the sill. There's no more story to tell, mate. Toad, he's... Stories have made no sense. You didn't forget your keys. You didn't bump the lamp off the table. You want to tell me what's going on? She doesn't think much of me, I don't think. Oh, I wouldn't necessarily say that. You might want to go back Progress. in that room. Mr. Toad, you're bleeding. Take off the hat. Yeah, he got bashed over the head with the lamp. <sighs> it was that butcher, a, a tweedle, dumb or dee. You gotta strip them down to their johnnies before you can tell which is which. They come bulging in, screaming about something the woodsman had. Or thought he had, I don't know. He tore up the place, beat me up when I said I didn't have it. I tried to go out the window. But he pulled me back in. It's been a hard morning, I could tell you that. Do you know what he was looking for? I have no idea. I would have told you. I wanted to, really, I did. But he said if word of this ever got back to him, if he ever thought you knew, or Miss White, he'd come back and kill my boy. Hmm. I even tried to give the bastard a coat. He wouldn't take it. Whose coat? The girl. Dad borrows things from people who live here. Uh, he sometimes. Borrows. <laughs> I don't steal nothing. <laughs> Turn around here would astonish you, mate. We'll merely repossess what's been left behind. Well, we'll be taking the coat now. If she has next of kin, family, anyone. All right. Fetch him the fur. Fine bit of dress it is. No, he hid in the fireplace. No, I wouldn't wear it outside. It's too big for you anyway. Wait. What's this? Note. It's an envelope. Fucking hell, of course there is. For my luck, it's a map to some bloody doubloons. It's addressed to Prince Lawrence. Do you want to... Try and give it to him, or we're gonna go there anyway. Eh. Don't make it a dilemma. Eh. 
Just open it. Let's just keep it for now. Okay. Well, it's been quite a surprising day for all of us, hasn't it? I'd see you out, but I'm afraid of dripping any more blood in the place. Hm. We'll leave. It was very nice talking to you, TJ. Thanks. Uh, see ya. Freaking tiny. Well, that was eventful. Got some more clues. Does it always go that smoothly? <laughs> Not often. So, the prince is now? Lawrence's, yeah. It's our best lead. Our only so it's good really. that we came here anyway. When you put it that way. We could have missed out on that probably if we didn't. If we chose to go with Lawrence first. But I figured this might help out anyway. South Bronx, Lawrence's apartment. Apparently, it took a long time. I don't want to stay here any longer than we have to, so let's just pick an approach and stick to it, okay? A little laggy. Just humor me. Let's just keep our focus on questioning Lawrence. Where she was, who she was with, that sort of thing. Okay. South Bronx, the South South Bronx. I think he might be dead. He might have killed himself. Don't just peep into someone's house. Check if he's home. Can you hear me? I think he's dead. I'd kill himself after doing it. Yep, he is dead. That's what I thought. That is what I thought. Oh my god. Oh, he's not dead. Hey, hey! You're gonna be okay. Just no, no. Let me go. <laughs> she. What is it that you're telling us? Oh. Oh. Wow. Water. Vicky, water. Kitchen. Okay. Where the heck is your kitchen? Oh, there it is. Okay. Did you find it yet? Not yet. Just busy looking around the place. Something to ask him. You should do it now. What happened? What happened? <laughs> Faith. Faith. What about her? God damn it. We didn't get anything out of her. That was a waste of water. Do you still have that letter? Mm -hmm. Let's look at it. 
Should I open it? I'm not sure if it's right. Your decision. It's your decision. Do what you think is right. I need to know. What does it say? Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Faith. It's only two words, but he died without seeing them. I'm sorry too. Hmm. We need to figure out what happened here and find whoever did this. Two words. Bullet passed through the chair. Yeah, the angle works if he shot himself. Yep. Either he killed himself, or someone got him. When do you think that was taken? Before all this. Strange. Hard edge to this pool, like something was here and got moved. Go in there in a bit. Still a little sticky. Sticky, sticky. Touching all the murder stuff. The mirror showed me this. I mean, we're touching all the evidence. Yeah, I should have come here first. It's sharp. And there's blood on the blade. I just don't understand. Why would someone want to kill him? Maybe kill himself. Could have been prevented if we came here first. Maybe. It's like he was what depressed. Prescription sleeping pills. What is it? This gun wasn't fired recently. Maybe a week ago. Or more. Should we touch it? Fingerprints? They'll be on the grip and the trigger. Let's take the casing as well. It matches the caliber of the gun on the floor. We got a fan. That doesn't really help. I think that might be it here. We're going to check this room out in a second.